Say, Father. Shout it, let it be with all your heart. Say, Father. In this season, I decree and declare that I'm going forward. I'm making progress. Lift your voice and begin to pray. Decree and declare in this season, someone is praying. You came for a miracle service. Command your own progress in this season. Shalika peka paraka tabarato siata. In this season, I decree and declare, I make progress. I make progress by the power of the Holy Ghost. Progress spiritually. Someone is praying. Progress in business. Progress academically. Progress maritally. Someone open up your mouth and pray. Progress. Progress. Someone is praying in the name of Jesus. In this season, I make progress in ministry. I make progress in this season. I go forward. Every delay, every stagnation against my life, against my progress, I come against you. Someone is praying. A believer is praying. I make progress. I make progress. I make progress. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name we pray. This is August the eighth month. We are stepping into September the ninth month. And the Bible says, As soon as Zion travails, she shall put forth her son. Is someone ready to pray? Shout it, say, Father, in the name of Jesus, I decree and declare every vision, every prophetic word that is still hanging over my destiny as I step into this month and September. Let it manifest. Open your mouth and pray. Let it manifest. Let it manifest. Every vision, every prophetic word, someone pray. Let it manifest. Great things that have been spoken concerning me. Let it manifest. Let it manifest. The increase. Let it manifest. Someone you are praying. Breakthrough. Let it manifest. Open doors. Let it manifest. Let it manifest. By the power of the Holy Ghost. You are praying. Let it manifest. Shakata pakata lakata. Let it manifest. Let it manifest. Someone pray, my marital destiny, let it manifest. That pregnancy, let it manifest. The arrival of that anointing, let it manifest. The open doors, let it manifest. My prosperity, let it manifest. The ministry of destiny help us, let it manifest. As soon as Zion travails, travail it in prayer, let it manifest. Let it manifest. Let it manifest. Let it manifest. In the name of Jesus, let it manifest. In Jesus name we pray in Jesus name we pray how many of you are ready to rebuke the spirit of delay you're going to shout this let it be from the depth of your heart that there are many things God has said should be by now but there are spirits that have vowed that you will never see the faithfulness of God in that area now is the time to clear them out of the way are you ready to pray Shout it, say, Father. Father. Shout it again, say, Father. Father. 
in the name of Jesus every delay over my life over my destiny by the blood of the eternal covenant that delay is broken now open your mouth and pray broken now broken now delay broken now go ahead and pray delay broken now delay broken now delay mention every area of your life cause delay cause delay cause delay call it by name cause it by the blood of the lamb Take a minute and cause delay. There must be results in my life in this season. I cause delay. I cause delay in ministry. I cause delay in destiny. I cause delay over your children. Cause delay over your spouse, over your business. Delay. Delay. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name we pray. When it was time for Isaac to bless his sons, the blessing was to go to Esau. But because a secret that was in the heart of Isaac was made open, Rebekah had it. And when she had it, she called Jacob. She said, something that should come to your brother, I want it to come to you. And as if it were a joke, eventually Jacob received that blessing. And Esau cried and said, is, is there nothing left? Let me tell you the truth. When matters leave the heart of God, you are not the only one who hears it. That God said, I want to bless you. It's not only you who hears it. The gates of hell, wickedness, powers, and everybody is also interested in that prophecy. What God told you is also of interest to demons. Is also of interest to wicked men. But it is your own responsibility to war in the place of prayer. And say that which is a portion for me. It must never be diverted in this season. That which is a portion for my destiny, it will not be aborted in the spirit. Is someone ready to open your mouth and pray? Go ahead and pray. That which God has declared concerning me, it will not be diverted by wizardry. It will not be diverted by powers manipulating the heavens. I decree and declare that which has been spoken concerning me. Oh, I will not make the mistake of Esau. I wore a good warfare with the prophecy. I wore a good warfare. My bishopric, another will not take. My bishopric, another will not take. Pray. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name we pray. Don't be tired of praying. You're partnering with God to produce victory. Now we're going to pray. We are going to call forth by faith the human agents who have been mandated to partner with prophecy so that it will be manifest in your life. 
you can call by faith remember i have taught you because one man forgot joseph added two years in prison so when god speaks the manifestations of his word is not just mindset dependent you have been taught here that it's also men dependent we have dealt with the issue of mindset someone is going to pray shout it from the depth of your heart say father, father. every human agent who must come into partnership with prophecy for my sake i cry unto you may they arise now open your mouth and pray open your mouth and pray help us of the war open your mouth and pray endorse us open your mouth and pray don't be silent don't be careless declare by faith ordained by God to partner with your rising ordained by God to wipe the tears of shame from your eyes ordained by God to see to your lifting ordained by God every human agent decree and declare they rise for your sake they come to the rescue for your sake every human agent mandated by God anointed by God the father of spirits to show up in this ministry to show up in my life to show up in my destiny bringing direction enhancing my lifting I call them forth by faith I call them forth by faith I call them forth by faith In Jesus name we pray in Jesus name we pray two more prayer points don't be tired you are returning with your testimonies for sure in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus you still believe in speed hmm. yes sir that in four months God is still able to bring you acceleration who believes that shout it after me with all your heart say father, father. even now father. I still believe for speed for acceleration open your mouth and pray even now even now it is August but I still believe for my company it is August but I still believe for speed in ministry speed in my destiny shake away unbelief and pray speed someone pray speed in establishment speed in your finances Lord do in one month what has not been done in five years Jehovah do in one month what has not been done in five years do in one month what has not been done in five years bring speed to my destiny bring speed to my destiny go ahead and pray pray with faith speed to my destiny speed 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 even now I believe you for speed in ministry even now I believe you for speed in destiny Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Mary cried and said, It's too late. The man is dead three days. He said, If you were here, 
Lazarus would not have died. But he said, even now, even now, huh, even now, it is August. I feel that we should still pray that prayer again. We should pray. I don't know. It may not be for everybody. Father, do in one month what has not been done in five years. Go ahead and pray. Do in one month in my life. Do in one month in the life of my spouse. Do in one month in the life of my children. Do in one month in the destiny of Nigeria. Do in one month in my business. God can bring speed. Speed in your finances. God can change the report in one month. I declare restoration by the power of the Holy Ghost. I declare restoration in the name of Jesus. Restoration in my body. Restoration according to the word of the Lord. According to the word of the Lord. Restoration in ministry. Restoration of opportunity. Restoration of opportunity. By the power of the Holy Ghost, we declare restoration. 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 By the power of the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Exodus chapter 14 from verse 13. We are praying. And Moses said unto the people, Fear not, stand still and see the salvation of the Lord, which he will show you today. For the Egyptians whom ye have seen today, ye shall not see them no more forever. Listen, hold on, just go back to 13. Go back to 13. We are going to declare. There are things you should see every day. The goodness of God. The mercy of God. But there are things you should never see. Failure. Disappointment. Are you ready to pray? Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Failure. Failure. Disappointment. Disappointment. Shame. Shame. Reproach. Reproach. Everything, Everything. That is Antichrist. That is anti I declare. I be banished from my sight. From and from my life. From Lift your voice and pray. These Egyptians I see today, in the name of Jesus, I see them no more and forever. These Egyptians I see today, I see them no more and forever. This Egyptians I see today, I see them no more and forever. This Egyptians I see today, I see them no more. Egyptians of sickness, Egyptians of shame, Egyptians of reproach. I curse you by the God of heaven in the name of Jesus, out of my sight and out of my destiny. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. 
verse 14 same exodus the lord will fight for you hear me it matters who fights for you it matters who fights for you are we together the bible talks about not being able to step into a house and spoil the house except you bind the strong man and it has to be one who is stronger than the strong man who binds him are you ready to pray the bible says the lord fights for you god is a warrior he can fight for men listen there are situations some of you are here what is you may not have sickness in your body but what is plaguing you only god can fight it hear me there are battles that are not for you you don't have that power your job is to invite god into it and step back are you ready to pray say father father in the name of jesus arise as a mighty warrior fight for me lift your voice and pray lift your voice and pray please be serious please be serious please be serious pray fight for me fight for me in the name of jesus this battle attempted to destroy my family fight for me fight for me give me peace fight for me this battle over my health fight for me this battle over the ministry fight for me someone is praying Fight for me, fight for me, fight for me, fight for my family, fight for the ministry, fight for my finances, fight for my children. In the name of Jesus, arise, oh God, arise, oh God, arise, oh God, arise, oh God, fight for me, fight for me. Fight for me. You are praying miracles to your life. Fight for me. Fight for me in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Verse 15. Ha! Ah, this is for someone. And the Lord said, since you have asked me to fight for you, let me tell you what happens when I fight for you. He says, speak unto the children of Israel that they go forward. Listen, listen, listen. Your children represent anything and anyone under your care. Your body is under your care. It falls into that category. Your finance is under your care. Are you ready to speak? He tells you the command. Go not backward. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I declare. I declare to my destiny. To my to my, destiny, to my body. To my body, to my family. To my, family, to my children. To my, children, to my job. To, my to, job, to ministry. To ministry. Hear the word of the Lord. Go forward. Lift your voice and declare. Go forward. Go forward. Go forward. Go forward. Go forward. Every family here. Help them please. Help those under the anointing. Go forward. Prophesy. Go forward. Go forward. Go forward. Go forward. Go forward. Spiritually. Go forward. Mentally. Go forward. Academically. Go forward. Go forward. Go forward. We declare. We declare. Go forward. In your health. Go forward. In your influence. Go forward. 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 Go for
service you will not forget believe me you may not know what is being created in your destiny fire is burning here second timothy 1 verse 7 because now we have prayed to go forward but for many of us there is a reason why you may not go forward fear 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 of the red sea fear Fear. No one in my family has done this before. Fear. You mean I can do a PhD? No one in my family has done it before. Fear. You mean I can be a kingdom financier? I came from a background where nobody has risen. I can have children that glorify God. Fear. Look up. The Bible says for God had not given Joshua Selman the spirit of fear. I've taught you this, that fear is a gift. Someone gives it and someone receives it. Anything receivable can be rejected. But of power and of love and of the sound mind. Please, this prayer, pray it radically and with passion. Listen, listen. Many of us, if you had conquered fear, you will not be at this level now. Fear. Fear to build a house. Fear to step out of your parents' house and begin to live responsibly. Fear. Every time God speaks, you chicken out. Fear. God has not given you. House of God, hear me. He has not given you the spirit of fear. So if you find it in your life, you receive it from someone else. Are you ready to pray? Say, Father, Father, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, you have not given me, you have not given me the spirit of fear. The spirit of fear. Therefore, therefore, I decree and declare, decree and declare every manifestation of fear in my life, in my mind, in my destiny. I cast you now. You lift your voice and pray. Fear, fear of the future. Fear of the past. Fear of tomorrow. Fear of remaining alive. Fear of living in this turbulent time. In the name of Jesus, I cast out fear. I cast out fear. I cast out fear. I cast out fear. Is someone praying? I reject the spirit of fear. Fear. 
Don't be tired of praying. This is a miracle service. I sense in my spirit that God knows why he organized this time of prayer. There is something that is happening. Believe me. Ephesians chapter 6. Ephesians chapter 6. Give us verse 11 and 12. We we'll start from verse 11. Put on the whole armor. Now pay attention. We are praying a serious prayer now. Put on the whole armor of God. It's risky to put part. Put on the whole armor of God. I have a series on this. That ye may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. There is something called the wiles, the arsenals, the weaponry of Satan. That the cure for being hit by the weapons of Satan is put on how many? Verse 12. For we wrestle not against flesh. Kaduna state, Plateau state, North, Nigeria, we are not wrestling against flesh and blood. More than men that fight the purposes of God, there are principalities, there are powers, there are rulers of the darkness of this world. There is spiritual wickedness in heavenly places. Are you ready to pray? We are going to declare. We are going to step into five minutes of prophetic intercession. Bring the entire middle belt. Bring this country and say in the name of Jesus, Father, fire from the heaven. In the name of Jesus, lift your voice and begin to pray. We pray for Plateau State. We pray for Kaduna State. We pray for Zaria. We pray for the middle belt. We pray for the east, we pray for the north, we pray for the south, we pray for the west, but more importantly, we pray for the middle belt. By the blood of the Lamb, we decree and declare spirits hovering around this territory, sucking the blood of men and eating the flesh of God's creation. The Lord rebuke you. 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 The Lord r
rebuke you. The Lord rebuke you. The Lord rebuke you. The Lord rebuke you. Sabatatakatos. Ebrakatabatatos. Ebrakataskatabatatos. We pray for the peace of Jerusalem. We pray for the peace of Jerusalem. We pray for the peace of Jerusalem. The Lord rebuke you in the name of Jesus. Principalities, powers, spirits over territories. We come against you by the blood of the Lamb. We come against you by the blood of the eternal covenant. In the name of Jesus. We come against you by the blood of the Lamb. We come against you in the name of Jesus. We come against you by the power of the Holy Ghost. We come against you in the name of Jesus Christ. Hear me. Hear me. Please listen to me. We have a responsibility as the church of the Lord Jesus Christ to pray and reorder things. They use divination in the day of Esther to find out what day they will attack the Jews. There must be an alignment of the constellations and the elements of creation. But all of the elements of creation were put together for man's victory. Are we together? Yes. You are going to pray. We are going to call forth in the ministry of angels. Are they not ministering spirits? Send to minister to dead that be the heirs of salvation. In the name of Jesus, lift your voice and pray. The angels, the ministry of angels, angelic ministry. In the name of Jesus. The ministry of angels. The ministry of angels. The ministry of angels. The ministry of angels. Over every home. Over every home. Over every region. Hallelujah. Now listen please Listen I'm sure the weather should be a bit calm now Soon would, 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 not, would not stay here necessarily long Let's take the last one or two prayer points You're going to pray for your family now Hear me Take what I'm telling you seriously So that you do not go out and come back And hear that you are the only one who is alive Who is left you are going to pray. He says, when I see the blood, there is the mystery of the blood. He said, Moses, an angel of death is about to pass. Shit. But you get the blood. Don't put it on your lintel. He says, if I see the blood, I will pass over. So, are you ready to place the blood upon yourself and your loved ones? Say, Father, 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 in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I plead the blood of Jesus over my life, over my family, over my children. Oh, death, oh, waster, you have no place in my home. Lift your voice and begin to pray. Rebuke the waster. Rebuke the waster. Rebuke the waster. Rebuke the waster. The waste that comes as incurable diseases, the waste that comes as external attacks, rebuke the waste. Oh, waste, there is the blood upon the lintel of my destiny, upon the lintel of my home. Rakata, 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 rakata
Every waste of life, of potentials, every waste by the blood of the eternal covenant, we are covered, covered in the morning, covered in the afternoon, covered in the night, covered in my going out, covered in my coming in. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Please look up. Hallelujah. We are going to pray for the security operatives. You see, in truth, the horse is prepared for battle, but safety is of the Lord. It takes the wisdom of God to direct them to know what to do. Abba, we have to pray. Oh. Say, Father, Father, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, give our security operatives give our security wisdom, 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 insight, insight, both technical, both technical and, spiritual, and spiritual, to be able to establish peace to over to our, our territories. Over Lift our your territory. voice and pray. Wisdom, insight, wisdom. Wisdom, insight, to know what to do. Insight, to know what to do. Wisdom, to know how to engage. <laughs> In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Last prayer point. You are going to pray for yourself. Death is a spirit. Untimely death is a spirit. The assignment of untimely death is to cut short your life and your destiny. Please listen to me. There are times where people finish their assignment with nobility and honor and they transit with honor. The Bible calls it sleeping with the fathers. Hear me. For believers, the Bible does not say we die. The Bible says we sleep. And they that sleep, sleep in the night. Is that true? When you lie down in the afternoon, it's, it's called siesta. You sleep for one hour and stand up. Believers don't die. Believers sleep. And we sleep in the night. Not in the morning. Not in the brightness of the afternoon. Listen to me. You are going to pray. Don't fear death. I know for many of you, you may have lost loved ones. It's all right. But there is this growing fear. Oh, pastors are dying. Businessmen are dying. Those who love the Lord are dying. Prayer warriors are dying. And the devil can say, what makes you think you will stand? This is it. Fear. Death is a terrorist. Until you are bold enough to confront the spirit of death. One day it will sweep you just like that. Hear me. We don't fight death because we are afraid. There is already victory in the life here. And even in the life to come. But that you need to live to finish your assignment. There are many people who have gone today and left trouble behind. Children, no, look at people just get scared. Small headache and someone tells you, you go online to read something and he said, these are the signs. Nine out of every ten. Please, you are going to pray for yourself. I don't know about you, but I must finish my course. I must finish my course in the name of... This is not a corporate thing. This is an individual thing. Lift your voice and declare. I shall not die. But leave and declare the word of the Lord. I rebuke the spirit of death. I speak life, life, longevity, the fullness of my days. I fulfill. Are you speaking? Don't keep quiet. Don't keep quiet.
I reject it in the name of Jesus Christ. The fullness of my days I received. The fullness of my destiny I received. I live out my destiny in the name of Jesus Christ. My God shall supply all my needs according to his riches in glory. He will put his angels charge over me. Jehovah Jireh cares for me. Jehovah Jireh cares for me. Jehovah Jireh cares for me. Let your spirit hear you say, Jehovah cares for me. Jehovah cares for me. Five more times. Jehovah cares for me. cares for me. This is the basis of our confidence. So we do not weep because the book is open. Now I want to pray for you. Now listen, here's how we're going to do it. Um or I think what we'll do is how many of you have your prayer request here this is what we'll do just bring out your prayer request our ushers be our just you can pass it to the last person let's have it here so that when I pray for you we may not have people come out because the place is jam-packed so whoever is under the anointing right where you are you help them just where you are but please write if you still want a few minutes to quickly write your prayer request please sit down if you have any medical condition sit down Generally, just sit down. Please, just one minute so you write it very quickly. You can help the ushers collect and just pass it to them. My God shall supply all my needs according to his riches in glory. He will put his angels charge over me. That God will give you a testimony in this miracle service and you will never forget that you came here in the presence of God now while they are collecting the prayer request let me just direct you on what we are going to do listen please pay attention when we collect it we'll have it here I'm going to be ministering deliverance and ministering healing all at once. Here's what I want you to do for me, please. If anyone is under the anointing close to you, you don't have to bring them out because we are jam-packed. Just help them and guide them. Let me do the prayer. And then for the sick, we may not have the time to take testimonies. It's already time. Thank God for the rain. You are not going anywhere. We'll wait here. We'll pray. And then I'll teach. Once the rain is calm, we'll be ready to go. But please, don't waste this time. God is already making it a most profitable time. A most profitable time of prayer. Please submit the prayer request very quickly. Those following online, you can submit it by way of um, our social media platforms. You may want to suspend this for a while. The fan is interrupting this. Just shift it or take it back or just suspend it for a while so we can have the request here. Have the faith to write what must live your life. Don't say I wrote it before. If it's still here, write it again. Write it till it leaves. Force it to live by faith. 
write it till it leaves in the name of Jesus Christ just take it back you don't have to offer it we still need it just take it back that's all hallelujah help the lady who shouts now under the anointing I thought we'll have to collect this but the Spirit of God is already moving whether you are an usher or not just help her just help her help her in the name of Jesus God is already bringing deliverance this lady wearing green this one standing I just saw light and the Lord is visiting both her and her family in the name of Jesus Christ I don't know who she is but by the power of the Holy Spirit no 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 don't worry you don't have just help them we can we may not be able to shift people up and down whoever is there you can help the ushers in the name of Jesus I pray for you by the power of the Holy Spirit in the name of Jesus Christ I'm hearing a name Justina who is Justina you are Justina mama please stand up please stand up I want to pray for you in the name of Jesus Christ just focus on submitting your prayer request and then pay attention and let the Lord help you in the name of Jesus Christ there are many families here that need to be delivered from oppression I don't know how it will happen but the rain will not stop us we must pray it we must pray that fire must fall upon the people that need to be delivered name of Jesus the Lord is showing me someone you came here you've been married two years no issue no fruit of the womb who is that two years I'm not saying if you need a child I'm just saying exactly let's just work with what God is saying are you here alone is your wife here careful careful don't don't let's be orderly let's be orderly God is helping us let's celebrate Jesus for them come mama just a moment I'll pray with you let me just are you married I want to pray for you where are you coming from don't cry Taraba. don't cry huh? Taraba. you came from Taraba oh my god how about you sir Katsina State Katsina judge you came from judge you came from Abuja yes. two years you're trusting God look at me there is power in the name of Jesus I assure you there is power in the name of Jesus animals don't attend a miracle service and yet God himself in his mercy brings fruitfulness every act of unfruitfulness is an attack from hell it doesn't matter what medical form and expression it comes under and for God to have located you I want to speak stand in faith believing that God will bring it to an end and that you stand on this altar and still testify of that fruitfulness you believe that in the name of Jesus I pray for you by the power that raised Christ from the dead I declare right now everything stopping fruitfulness I don't care how long two years sir the power of God is coming on you I'm seeing something like light in the name of Jesus Christ I decree and declare let it be over right now for you and your wife I cost that devil in the name of Jesus Christ my dear what's your name huh? Rachel I'm Rachel Kwaba, is it Kwaba? What's your name? Wama. Wama. Yes, sir. Let me pray for you. Look at me. Where is your husband? He's at the park. 
He's at work. He's a military man. Yes, sir. I want to pray for you. I'm not a prophet of doom. But in the name of Jesus, it will never be said your husband has gone to glory and left you alone. Amen. You see what I'm telling you? Which barrack? Um, NMS, Depot, Nigeria. Depot. Yes, sir. Father, in the name of Jesus, I cancel this that you have shown me. We declare for the sake of your mercy, preserve our husband. And any power fighting your husband to bring him to the grave in the name of Jesus we silence that power now I decree and declare right now it's time for you to celebrate fruitfulness receive that grace my sister receive that grace my brother receive that grace you will return with your testimony in the name of Jesus Christ mama I want to pray for you that in the name of Jesus Christ please stand up man the Lord is bringing favor for you supernatural favor by the Spirit the Lord is saying I should tell you not to worry worry will increase your BP but the Lord is stepping in for you he's bringing a miracle for you in the name of Jesus Christ the Lord do this miracle he will give you this great miracle by the power of the Holy Spirit in the name of Jesus Christ in the name of Jesus Christ now I'm, I'm, I'm going to pray for the sick but I'm seeing someone You've been having pain this looks like appendicitis this is pain around your right I'm feeling that pain now around my right please you may need to turn this fan our direction and we need the fan just shift it backwards and turn so that we can have it what's your name my dear huh? Josephine Josephine yes sir. can I pray for you yes, sir. how long has this been since I lost my brother the same thing. when did you lose your brother um, June June 18 in the name of Jesus Christ just lay your hands all of you standing here lay your hands I declare by the power of the Holy Spirit everything manifesting as appendicitis now let them go by the power of the Holy Spirit I'm seeing fire just move across you in the name of Jesus Christ I bring you life by the Spirit of the Living God I call my God my God I'm, I'm seeing fire that's just what I'm seeing let there be healing right now be healed by the power of the Holy Spirit in the name of Jesus be healed help them by the power of the Holy Spirit every demon of darkness manifesting as appendicitis or every lower abdominal problem I come against it in the name of Jesus let there be a miracle for you be healed right now in Jesus name hallelujah now I'm going to pray I'm going to rebuke spirits please just help those who begin to manifest something is living that lady I cost that devil the lady wearing that cap Satan lose her now I just saw like a spirit I command you release our destiny now in the name of Jesus the Christ of God release our destiny now can I pray for you now I believe in the power of the Holy Spirit those outside I know you can still hear me all the overflows as many who can hear and following online let's pay attention right now I decree and declare at the count of three I want you to shout Jesus everyone here who is under the influence of any spirit you don't have to bring them out just hold them where they are right now I decree any spirit that has gained access to your destiny the Bible says they overcame them by the blood of the Lamb as you shout that name that is above every other name I command that spirit to let you go once and for all are you ready now at the count of three one two three shout Jesus I command that devil to go now I command every foul spirit release their destinies now in the name of Jesus just help those under the anointing let the fire from heaven right now in Jesus name every spirit shying down to destiny be released from every evil from the front to the back inside outside be delivered now help them please be delivered now 
now listen to me help that lady any family here that is corporately under siege not just one person everybody in the family is under a yoke and a pattern nobody moves forward right now may fire from heaven fall right now may fire from heaven fall right now the fire from heaven fall upon that family help them please fall from heaven